have recording resumed. Thank you. Uh, all right, Flynn. Oh, you have your special now. Awesome. Uh, we're gonna learn that first then. Give you a costume. I want you to wear... Stick with the, uh, you could stay with the knight, honestly. All right, on stage. Rita, you were resisting at first, but you really got into the act, didn't you? N no, you were just taking your part so seriously. I had no choice but to follow along. Your costume was pretty cute, too. What a nice treat for all of us. Hey! Your acting was really on point, Carol. <laughs> well, I used to be in the Actors Guild after all. You've been in all sorts of guilds, kid. Anyway, that wasn't even acting. I'd like to act in another play with everyone else someday. No way. Never again. Me neither. I don't want Rita to set me on fire again. I'd like to be in the play next time. I'd have to be the lead, of course. I had my doubts, but it looks like everyone had a good time. Oh, yeah, totally. That was that was amazing. I love that side quest. We are going to fight Gosh and Draw right now. Uh, Give me Flynn. I got Yuri. Uh, I don't know. Nah, I keep this team. But I'm sure you have a lot to catch up on. Oh, you have Holy Lance now. That's really cool. Never did this because that was from the secret mission, which still sucks. Got Beast, got Demonic Circle. Give me Demonic Circle. That works. Alright. I think. Actually, wait, there's a. Oh, you can learn uh, art with Yuri. Might as well get that art before moving on. Why would I not, right? I think comment down Flynn, welcome back. Someone please show me to show them to their rooms. Yes, right this way. Let's go. All right. Oh, is this for a? Uh... This is for the art, right? You really have time to be lounging around. We can't afford to make any mistakes. We have to be careful about things. That doesn't sound like you, Yuri. Aren't you the one who's always acting irrational and reckless? Nah, I think you're thinking of yourself, Flynn. I can't imagine you'd be hesitating at this point, so what is it you need? Is it, it is just some... It, is it some encouragement? I'm still looking for the right finishing move. Oh, this is the thing. If that's the case, maybe I could be of assistance. I appreciate the help. I'll take you up on your offer. Excellent. This is for the art. I was confused at first. Oh, I slept so nicely. I tried shaking you and calling your name, but you wouldn't wake up. I thought you were gone, Rita. Oh, what a relief. We must have been more tired than we thought. Are those two still at it? Yeah, they've been fighting with hardly a moment's rest ever since they started. They look like they're enjoying themselves. They've got some nerve. When are we gonna- They got some nerve. When are we gonna leave? It's stiff- It's stifling here. I'm going to do some maintenance on Vesperia number one. Oh, I'll help. I'd say Reed is pretty similar, really. Oh, love this art. The art we're about to get is... That was... Yep, looks like you got the hang of it. Yeah, thanks, man. Yuri, Flynn. Are you finished? Yeah, sorry to keep you waiting. Alright, shall we go? Huh, hold on, let me just rest a little bit. We don't have time to be lounging around. Alright, last one there's a rotten egg. Carol could be a rotten egg. Good luck out there. Leave it to me. Oh, right, Flynn doesn't come with me. Oh, I love that. Final Gale. I love that art. Telling of the telling of the changing world. I hope everyone will accept this. 
I mean, that the world is changing. There's a difference between understanding something and accepting something. It'll take time. But this is the only way that's left. We just have to accept it. This isn't a choice we've made freely. We had to choose it. Not everyone will welcome it, that's for certain. But... It's something we have to do. That's what you want to say, right? Y yeah That's fine, then. Cheer up, Carol. Okay. You think it'll work out, right? Who knows? Judith, I can't tell if you're trying to make me feel better or not. What you want is different from what's actually there. Reality can be a harsh mistress. Yeah, sure. All right, we are going to rest at the end, too. There's a scene there. Might as well get it while we're in Arnian. Uh, is this another side quest I did? Have we met somewhere before? You helped us up back at Kapwanor. That was back when you captured Alexei by... Captured... You were captured by Alexei. You could use healing arts? Huh? You could tell? All healers have a characteristic mark on their left thumb from which their arts are released when they're used. There's a little dark spot you could just... You could tell from just this. Doctors have to be observant. Plus, I'm a practitioner of healing arts as well. Oh, is this just showing the inn being effective? Grandma suddenly started feeling ill. It's too late, Doc. I'm not long for this world. Oh no, this is serious. Hold on, the healer can't let herself get flustered when they are sick of people to help. Ma'am, could you tell me what sort of discomfort you're having and where it hurts? My side hurts, like it's being squeezed real tight and my fingers feel all stiff. Oh, let's... let me have a look. Don't know what side quest this is part of. I feel all better. Thank you, doctor. Oh, you don't need to thank me. This is my job. You were using your healing arch precisely, only on the parts of their body that needed it. That takes some skill. It can actually be harmful to focus one's healing arts on healthy parts of the body. Really? If the healer works too hastily, she can cause her patient undue stress and worsen their conditions. The healer must always be calmed and focused. I see. Please excuse my ignorance. Ignorance. No, not at all. You're still learning. The path to becoming a healer is a tough one, to say the least. Please come and visit me again. There's much I'd like to teach you. What event was that? So, are you hoping to become a healer someday? No, but even so. The only thing I'm, I've am i been good at doing for others is healing their wounds. I'd like to learn more about what a healer does. I'd say you've done a lot more than us just... Than for us than just heal our wounds. Huh? Nah, forget it. Anyway, I don't think there's anything wrong with learning more about healing and seeing where it takes you. Yes. I don't know what event that was. Ready for the final battle, men. Whoa, what's the occasion? Little impromptu training session? Well, when I think about fighting Duke, I know I gotta be as strong as I can. I like your spirit. I'd expect that from Carol. Yuri brings a twinkle to this old man's eyes to see you training. On second thought, let's call it a day. What? We were just getting started. Never fear. I think I can teach you a thing or two. You can thank me later. <laughs> You're volunteering to help, Raven? You're gonna jinx him. <laughs> now, don't be like that. There's no beating an old man once he finds his stride, you know? Would you spar with me as well, Raven? Hey, well, if you both want to, I can't say no. It'll take more than luck to beat Duke, after all. All right, Carol, no mercy? Right. No mercy! Fight! All right, that's good. Oh, we have to enter again and talk to the doctor. I found the skid, the uh, thing this is part of. Hello. Oh, how are you? It looks like you're just fine. You could tell? Sure, I could tell from looking at your face. Ugh, doctor. Oops, I was working. Is that a patient of yours? Yes, it appears he has some sort of heart disease. Hold on, friend. I'll help take away the pain. Ugh, it hurts. Pain. It doesn't look like it's working. Huh? Amazing magical power. Uh, it doesn't hurt anymore. Good. Huh. Thank you, doctor. Yes, of course. Well, stay here a bit to get your energy back before you head out again. You have quite a rare talent, young lady. What? I do? I don't think. No, seriously. Being able to wield that level of healing arts is no small feat. 
Technically speaking, your skills are a little rough around the edges, but you're a born healer. Can't wait to see how well you'll turn out with a bit more training. Yes. Alright. I'm starting to feel like I'm deceiving that doctor. You mean because you don't actually want to become a healer? Yeah. It doesn't seem so bad to me. The hospital is hurting for, hurting for help and you're just giving them a hand. I'm sure they appreciate it and you can't help if they want to be someone you're not. Maybe you're right. I have to talk to you again. Speak with the man near the inn owner. Okay. Is this guy the inn owner? Oh, ready for final battle, woman. Is fighting really the only option with Duke? Well, if he's in Takaron, then I think we'll have to. My mind's already made up. If only we can defeat the Autophagos with the spirits before he completes the formula. Do you think he'll just let that happen? As long as he's sacrificing people to achieve his aims at Tarkaron, we have to stop him. <sighs> What's eating you, Estelle? Are you that conflicted about fighting him? Yes, but we won't win if we go in with doubts. Oh, I don't know. If doubting is part of your nature, you should trust that nature in battle. What? Well said, Judith. Maybe that's the right approach. We're not your typical band of heroes, after all. You do what you can. You take the hits, but you don't lose. Sound about right? I think that the more you fret, the brighter you'll shine, Estelle. You're all so... Thank you. Alright, that was nice. Uh, Doctor, thank you for your help the other day. Doctor? You mean me? Yes, of course. You treated me in the hospital the other- Yeah, words. Treated me in the hospital the other day. You're not usually working in the hospital, though, are you? No, I'm usually out traveling, but you know, I'm not really a doctor. Hey, what's up? Hello, random stranger. This is the doctor at the hospital I was telling you about. Oh, I didn't think she'd be this young. Maybe I'll go and pay you a visit sometime soon. My shoulder's been hurting me a bit lately, you see. Uh, but I'm not. Oh, so this is the famous doctor. Oh, Estelle's famous. Yeah, it's her. Thanks to this miracle worker, I'm the very picture of health. I see. Keep up the good work, doctor. Right. Thanks again, Doctor. If I feel sick, I'll be sure to come and see you. Uh, but you see... <laughs> horrible misunderstanding. Looks like you're developing quite a fan club, Estelle. Maybe you should start collecting magazines to put in your waiting room. This is a bit of a pickle. Oh, not really. The fame is good. Arnie and Spirit. Man, Arnie is just getting better and better. Indeed. A town born from the Empire and the Guilds. I'm sure it'll be a wonderful city. Though it's a shame it took a world crisis to get them to work together. <laughs> a global threat brings people together. That's irony for you. I think that's all right, though. They're finally seeing eye to eye. Right. And even if they need a crisis now, I'm sure one day it'll just come naturally. Indeed. It would be a shame if this cooperation was only temporary. I hope we can return and ensure that it is lasting. Me too. We have to take care of the Autophagos first, though. Pretty sure the the next event for her title is to have a certain amount of HP healed. So I don't think I don't think we healed the required amount of HP. So I think we're done for now. We're just gonna rest at the end and get this cutscene really quick. Um, to think of it, I forgot to ask. You said you were looking for a book. Why? Oh, did I say that? You can stop playing dumb, Judith. I'm not gonna fall for it anymore. He's my dad. Huh? Who is? Hermes. Oh, Hermes is your father. I thought it was Rita's father. Wait. This is not the event I wanted. Huh? What? What the? I mean, how? But you broke all those Blastia. I destroyed the Blastia precisely because it was my dad who made them. What? Why didn't you tell me that sooner? Don't you think that's important to know? I don't really think the connection between Hermes and myself is that important myself. Oh, so you don't seem to realize the importance of sharing any of your knowledge. So, you were going to destroy the blast seed your father has made to atone for his mistakes? No, I'm hardly that noble. I was just trying to clean up his mess before anyone else noticed. What do you mean, so you weren't doing it for the planet? You were doing it for your father. Yeah, I guess so. I can't, under I can't understand how you could... Feel that sort of sympathy. I don't have a father, so... You don't remember your father? 
He left right after I was born. There's no way I can remember him. I hardly even remember what my mother's face looked like. I see. What's that? It's a keepsake of my dad, a thermoblastia, used to measure temperature. He created some things that weren't harmful, too. Hermes must have really been amazing to create new blastia so easily like that. You can have it. What do you mean? Isn't the memento, uh, words, memento of your father? That's why I'm giving it to you. That's why you're what? I think you'd be a better person to have it than I would. I don't know much about Blastia anyway. Don't you think it's better for the Blastia if you're holding on to it? Wait, but why should I... You should keep the Blastia. Think of it as for your own good. For its own good. But... Alright, how about we call it a night? Uh... Good night. Good night. Alright. Hermes is Judith's father. Feel free to give it a name if you'd like. But I mean... Alright then. Juana it is. That's a cute name. I'm sure she's quite happy with it. Juana. Alright, well... That was not the event at Juana. What event was that, though? I don't know what event that was. Alright, an Arnian, not Sestel's teacher. I don't know what that was. Alright, that was weird. If I rest again, on to the last battle. So many skits. Forward to the very top of Tarkaron. Oh, you're full of vim, Patty. We're gonna need a whole lot of vim to take down that giant Atafagos. Just don't use it all up before we get there, okay? And with the Atafagos gone, it will be the dawn of a new world. One without Blastia. There's nothing to fear. Everyone will be able to move on even without Blastia. I'm sure of it. You saw Yoder and the people from the guilds in Ornian, right? With them in charge, people will learn to live, even if there are problems along the way. The possibilities are bigger than a blue whale! I believe that. Even without the Atafagos, there would be no future in sacrificing life after life like Duke did. And I intend to fight at your side to guarantee a better future, Yuri. I'm counting on you. Alright, so that was, uh, that was part of Judith's Brianak side quest then. Um, I probably should wrap up. Alright, yeah. Uh, we are gonna wrap up. I'm gonna walk as Rita to see if I remember to do the Brianak side quest. Might do that right now. But yeah, I'm gonna wrap up here. It's actually a good place to wrap up and all that. But, uh, yeah, I'll do that. But those of you watching, I hope you all enjoyed. And when we come back next time, we're gonna just tackle a bunch of side quests. Probably not going to finish all of them. Maybe we will. Maybe we won't. I'm not really sure. I don't think so, though. It might take the whole... It's going to take the whole stream if we do. But yeah. Made a lot of progress today. We're in the final dungeon. We're in the end game. We just have a bunch of side quests to take care of. And then, you know, we'll do that. But yeah. Um, No stream for the weekend. I'll be back on Monday. Probably... I'll probably do Vesperia on Monday. Or... I'll probably do something new. Possibly. Either I do Vesperia on Monday or something new. It highly depends on what I'm feeling, but we'll do that. And on Tuesday, I'll do whichever one I don't do, basically. So, yeah. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.